What's up, you guys? Today we're going to talk about how to be more authentic. And trust me, we're all working on that. We're trying to be just more of who we are and stop trying to fight against what others are trying to make us to be. So let's get into this right now. First one is be okay with making mistakes. My favorite interview that I had for a job was when someone asked me the question, what if you make a mistake? And I thought that was an incredible question because here I am in an interview just trying to prove myself to everybody and this person asked me, what if you make a mistake? So what was my answer? My answer was, well, I would just laugh it off and move on or maybe I would make it a teachable moment. But that's one thing about being authentic is we have to be okay with making mistakes. We are human beings. That's what we do. Sometimes we make mistakes. What we do is we learn from those mistakes and we need to learn how to do that in public when we're around people. Because guess what? You're going to make mistakes when you're around people. So you might as well learn, how do I react? What am I going to do when I make a mistake? But it's okay. That's what forgiveness is all about. So be okay with making mistakes. By the way, you have to learn how to forgive yourself. You have to learn how to say, you're, you know, I, I made the mistake and be okay with you making mistakes. Sometimes you have to say, man, you know what, I forgive myself, you know, and, and move on because you are going to make mistakes, okay, everybody is, but you're going to learn from them, and that's all that matters. Number two is really related, but kind of not, is be okay with being imperfect. Being okay, with, be okay with being imperfect. You are an imperfect being, and that's okay. So we're going to get into something called excellence versus perfection. Always strive for excellence. Do not strive for perfection. Perfection is not where it's at at all. Excellence is when you're always seeking to improve. Perfection is when you're always seeking to prove. You're trying to prove something. You're trying to show someone because you're afraid that they may see something imperfect in you. So you're trying to prove that you measure up to something that doesn't really exist. Excellence is when you're always trying to grow and you're excited actually about learning new things and being a better person each day. You're always seeking to improve every day because that's what you do. You are becoming a better person every single day. That's excellence. But if you're looking at perfection and you're trying to reach that, you're going to get frustrated and you may start to become critical of others and yourself. So you want to avoid that because criticism is related to perfection and it's not a good place to go. Uh, it may get you some things, but in the long run, it's going to be more harmful than helpful. So make sure that you're striving for excellence and it's okay to be imperfect when you're striving for excellence. Remember that fear of criticism is directly related to seeking to prove yourself. Your ability to take criticism in a good way, constructive criticism, is a great indicator and gauge of how you are seeking to improve and striving for excellence. Number three is this. Gladly be around people who love to be with other people that are different than them, that think differently than they do. Start loving that. And those people should be people that also love to be around people that are different from them. This is good for a lot of reasons, but just fall in love with diversity. And I don't mean just diversity in race, I mean diversity in the way people think, right? The way they think, as long as it's positive, productive, don't be afraid to be around people who think differently than you. Be around all kinds of people. Love people, love diversity, love a diverse group of people because you are who you are. Your core beliefs, don't be afraid of your core beliefs gonna change or be totally uh, mutated or something if you're around people that are different than you, okay? It, that the whole purpose of this is to learn from other people, understand that you are wonderfully made. The more you're around other people, the more you learn about who you were created to be. Don't worry about being sucked into something that you don't want to be a part of, okay? If you do, learn from it and become a better person. That's what excellence is all about. 
So don't be afraid of being around people who are different from you. As a matter of fact, love it and embrace it because you are who you are and you are going to be a blessing for other people. You're going to be a help for other people. And just be confident about that. Be very strongly confident about that and be around other people who think differently than you. That's it guys. I love you guys. I, want, I am so thankful for you guys and I want you to like and subscribe if you'd like all this content and please comment. I really want to know what you think. Okay, comment below. All right, and have a great day. I'll talk to you later. Have a wonderful day. We're gonna get in the red